Tim Henman joked that he deserved some of Daniil Medvedev's prize money as the world number three coincidentally won another tournament that the Brit attended. Tim Henman joked that he would be negotiating a deal with Daniil Medvedev's manager after the world number three win the Italian Open. The Brit noted that Medvedev had won the two Masters 1000 tournaments that he covered as a pundit, asking to receive a cut of the prize money. And the 27-year-old was happy to hear that Henman would be at the upcoming French Open, boosting his chances. Medvedev won the last four games of the Italian Open final against Holger Rune to clinch the title with a 7-5, 7-5 victory. It marks his 20th career title, with all of them coming across 20 different cities. And it was also the 27-year-old's first ever title on the clay, a surface he previously admitted to hating. After the trophy ceremony, Medvedev chatted to Henman for Prime Video and the former world number no. 4 propositioned him with something of a coaching offer as he asked to receive a cut of the prize money. Finally, I interviewed you after three matches in Miami and you won that tournament. I'm here after the final interviewing you and you've won this tournament, the retired pro pointed out. I'm just wondering whether there's a chance I might be part of the team bonus scheme that you're undefeated when I'm at the tournament. And Medvedev seemed receptive to the idea, as he responded, That sounds right. Will you be at Roland Garros? Henman replied, Yes I will be, and the newly crowned Rome champion was happy to hear it. Perfect, that's perfect. That's all I needed to know. If you would say no I would be like, why did you ask me this question? He laughed, as Henman made sure to put an agreement in place. Well I'm glad we've got that on film so I look forward to the negotiations with your manager, thank you, he joked, as Medvedev told him. Okay, call Ali. I don't know if you know him. Discussing his French Open chances with Henman, the world number no. three said he was feeling good ahead of the second major of the year. I'm feeling great. Physically I'm feeling great, he explained. I have few pains here and there but nothing serious. Going home tomorrow. Two days off there. Coming to Paris, I know how to prepare for the Grand Slams. But then you're going to get tough opponents so you need to be at your best but it's always great to win a Masters 1000 before a Grand Slam. That's the second time it happened to me, last time I made it to the final so I'm just looking forward to Paris. I love the tournament and hopefully can play well there. 